Welcome back to the Health Benefits Hub channel. Are you harming your kidneys without even knowing it? Many routine actions could be silently damaging your kidneys, posing a serious risk to your health. It's crucial to recognize these harmful habits before it's too late. Kidney issues often remain hidden until they reach a critical stage, causing symptoms like swelling, fatigue, and back pain. Once kidney disease progresses, treatment becomes challenging and expensive, with irreversible damage in most cases. Don't let bad habits lead to kidney failure, where dialysis or transplant becomes necessary for survival. Take control of your kidney health by adopting good daily habits. But first, let's uncover the 17 worst daily habits that could harm your kidneys. Stay tuned for practical tips to safeguard your kidneys and ensure your well-being. Remember, all information shared here is thoroughly fact-checked and reviewed. Let's dive into the silent threats lurking in your daily routines. Number 17. Don't skip exercise. Regular exercise offers a plethora of benefits for kidney health, including improved blood pressure, better sleep quality, and enhanced physical strength. However, skipping exercise can negate these benefits and may even worsen kidney function. It's crucial to find a balance and maintain appropriate exercise routines, especially for those with kidney concerns. Studies have consistently shown that inadequate physical activity can lead to decreased strength and exercise capacity, particularly in individuals with CKD chronic kidney disease. To break the habit of skipping exercise and support your kidneys, aim for at least 30 minutes of moderate activity each week. Start with gentle movements and gradually increase intensity to avoid injury. Tracking your progress and setting achievable fitness goals can help keep you motivated. Consider incorporating enjoyable activities like gardening or walking with friends to make exercise a fun and social habit. Oh, a quick favor, we greatly appreciate it. If you can subscribe and like this helps the YouTube algorithm recognize the value of our content, share it more widely. Number 16. Cut out soda. You might know that sodas aren't ideal, but their impact on kidney health is significant. Sodas, especially colas, pose a serious risk of chronic kidney disease CKD due to their high sugar and phosphoric acid content. The excess sugar in sodas can contribute to obesity, diabetes, and cardiovascular issues, all of which elevate the risk of CKD. Additionally, the phosphoric acid in colas can alter urine composition, increasing the likelihood of kidney stone formation. A 2014 study published in Nephrology Dialysis Transplantation found that regular consumption of sugar-sweetened sodas increased CKD risk by 58%, while artificially sweetened sodas raised the risk by 33%. Opting for healthier beverages like water and sweetened tea or low-fat milk can help mitigate the risk of CKD. Number 15. Ultra-processed foods. Eating processed foods, especially ultra-processed foods UPFs, can significantly impact kidney health. UPFs are packed with artificial additives, sugars, refined carbohydrates, and healthy trans fats, and excessive salt, making them tempting but detrimental to health. These foods lack essential nutrients like fiber and micronutrients and may even contain contaminants from the packaging process. Research shows a strong link between UPF consumption and kidney disease. A study published in the American Journal of Kidney Diseases revealed that individuals with chronic kidney disease who consumed more UPFs experienced worsened outcomes, including higher mortality rates. This underscores the critical role of dietary choices in managing kidney health. To safeguard kidney health, it's essential to limit UPF intake. Studies suggest that reducing UPF consumption can significantly lower the risk of kidney-related issues. Opting for a balanced diet rich in fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, and whole grains can support healthy kidneys and reduce the likelihood of conditions like high blood pressure and diabetes. Tracking your food intake in a journal can help identify unhealthy habits and make healthier choices. Additionally, consulting with a renal dietitian can provide personalized guidance on dietary adjustments to support kidney health and overall well-being. Remember, prioritizing nutrient-rich, whole foods over processed options is key to protecting your kidneys and maintaining optimal health. Number 14. Prolonged sitting. Prolonged sitting has been linked to an increased risk of kidney disease, even after considering factors like age, gender, and physical activity levels. Research spanning over two decades found that those who spent less time sitting had a lower risk of developing chronic kidney disease CKD. 
A recent study published in the Sports Medicine Journal analyzed data from over 450,000 participants and revealed that prolonged sitting at work was associated with a 26% CKD, a 19% dialysis, and a 43% death from kidney issues. Interestingly, even small amounts of exercise, like just 15 minutes a day, help mitigate these risks. To maintain kidney function, it's crucial to reduce prolonged sitting. You can incorporate movement by keeping a small bottle of water on your desk as a reminder to take breaks and stretch, giving your kidneys a much-needed rest from extended sitting. Number 13. Dehydration. Inadequate water intake can lead to dehydration, causing an imbalance of vital electrolytes like potassium phosphate and sodium. This imbalance disrupts the communication between cells, potentially resulting in seizures, muscle spasms, and loss of consciousness. Severe dehydration can even lead to kidney failure, posing life-threatening risks such as anemia, heart failure, and weakened immunity. Dehydration also increases the likelihood of kidney stones, urinary tract infections, and chronic kidney disease CKD. To prevent these complications, it's essential to maintain hydration levels consistently. Proper fluid intake not only replaces lost fluids but also helps the kidneys eliminate waste efficiently. However, excessive water consumption can be dangerous, particularly for individuals with kidney issues, as it can lead to electrolyte imbalances and symptoms like nausea, vomiting, headache, and confusion. Balancing hydration is crucial for kidney health and overall well-being. Maintaining adequate hydration is crucial for kidney health, as the kidneys play a vital role in regulating the body's fluid balance. Hormones like arginine vasopressin AP and components of the renin-angiotensin system influence the kidney's ability to manage water levels. High levels of AP can increase the kidney's workload by promoting water reabsorption. Drinking plenty of water can help lower AP levels, potentially reducing strain on the kidneys and supporting their optimal function. However, Research is ongoing to determine whether increasing urine output to protect kidney filtering capacity, especially in individuals with CKD, is advisable. Monitoring the color of urine is a simple way to gauge hydration levels. Ideally, urine should be a straw-colored or paler shade. Darker urine may indicate dehydration. Additionally, it's important to limit consumption of caffeinated, sweetened, and alcoholic beverages, as these can dehydrate the body. Opting for plain water is the best choice to stay adequately hydrated and support kidney health. Number 12. Smoking. Smoking poses significant risks to kidney health, both in the short and long term. In the short term, smoking can elevate blood pressure and heart rate, increasing strain on the cardiovascular system. Even exposure to secondhand smoke can elevate enzyme activity in the kidneys, leading to potential damage over time. Long-term smoking can reduce blood flow to the kidneys, contributing to conditions like peripheral arterial disease and arteriosclerosis, which affect renal arteries. For individuals with chronic kidney disease CKD, smoking exacerbates the risks of heart disease, hypertension, and diabetes, all of which can accelerate CKD progression towards kidney failure. Research published in the American Journal of Nephrology has highlighted a strong link between smoking and CKD progression, particularly in individuals with a high smoking intensity. Additionally, smoking is associated with an increased risk of proteinuria, indicating excessive protein in the urine, particularly in individuals with high blood pressure and elevated blood sugar levels. Number 11. Inadequate Sleep Inadequate sleep can hasten declines in kidney function and expedite chronic kidney disease CKD progression. Disrupted sleep patterns can hyperactivate the RAS, elevating blood pressure and straining the kidneys. Poor sleep often leads to non-dipping blood pressure at night, increasing the risk of CKD progression. Sleep deprivation also triggers inflammatory pathways, exacerbating kidney damage and worsening existing conditions. A study in the Journal of Clinical Sleep Medicine discovered that inadequate sleep duration correlated with an increased risk of CKD incidence. Sleep disorders like sleep apnea further compound kidney damage by causing nightly hypoxia, reducing oxygen levels, and exacerbating kidney function decline. Chronic sleep deprivation is associated with health issues like obesity, type 2 diabetes, and hypertension, all of which can initiate or worsen kidney damage over time. To combat insufficient sleep and safeguard kidney health, maintain a consistent sleep schedule, 
create a conducive sleep environment, engage in regular physical activity, and prioritize fresh air exposure for better sleep quality. Number 10. Excessive Alcohol Consumption Excessive alcohol consumption poses a significant risk to kidney health. The National Kidney Foundation warns that it doubles the likelihood of kidney disease. Alcohol overwhelms the kidneys, impeding their ability to filter toxins effectively and raising the risk of high blood pressure, a primary cause of kidney problems. Furthermore, alcohol-induced dehydration disrupts kidney function and disturbs the body's water and mineral balance. Liver disease resulting from alcohol abuse exacerbates kidney damage by impairing blood flow to the kidneys and increasing their workload. A study published in Nutrients in 2019 tracked 45,200 adults over 8.5 years, revealing a 15% increased risk of chronic kidney disease associated with heavy drinking. It's crucial, especially for individuals with medical conditions or taking specific medications, to either abstain from alcohol entirely or practice moderation. Number 9. Excessive Caffeine Consumption Excessive caffeine consumption, typically defined as exceeding 400 mg per day, can pose risks to kidney function, especially in individuals with specific genetic variants like the reference SNP 76255-1 variant in the CP1A2 gene. However, a study published in the Journal of Renal Nutrition in 2007 revealed that high daily caffeine intake might elevate the risk of acute kidney injury aka in thoracic cancer patients undergoing platinum salt chemotherapy. Among 108 patients receiving chemotherapy, 34 developed AKI, with those consuming over 386 mg of caffeine daily facing double the risk compared to moderate caffeine consumers. While moderate caffeine intake is generally acceptable for kidney health, caution is necessary, especially for heavy caffeine consumers or those with kidney issues. To mitigate excessive caffeine intake's adverse effects on kidney health, consider switching to decaffeinated coffee or tea for flavor and potential health benefits without caffeine's diuretic effects. Additionally, opt for alternative sources of energy such as water, fruits, and vegetables to stay hydrated and obtain essential nutrients. Limit or avoid foods and beverages naturally high in caffeine, such as dark chocolate and sodas like Coca-Cola and Mountain Dew. Number 8. Poorly Managed Diabetes Poorly managed diabetes poses a significant risk to kidney health. High blood sugar levels associated with diabetes can damage the blood vessels and nephrons in the kidneys, impairing their function and leading to chronic kidney disease CKD. In fact, diabetes is the leading cause of kidney disease, with about 1 in 3 adults with diabetes developing kidney issues, according to the National Institute of Diabetes and Digestive and Kidney Diseases NIDDK. The longer someone lives with diabetes, the greater their risk of developing kidney disease. This underscores the importance of effectively managing diabetes to prevent diabetic kidney disease DKD, which can progress to end-stage renal disease ESRD if left untreated. High blood pressure, a common complication of diabetes, can exacerbate kidney damage by further harming the blood vessels crucial for kidney function. Managing diabetes effectively involves not only controlling blood sugar levels but also addressing blood pressure and cholesterol levels. This comprehensive approach to diabetes management includes adhering to a healthy diet, engaging in regular exercise, taking prescribed medications, and attending regular medical checkups to monitor kidney function. By adopting these measures, individuals can significantly reduce the risk of kidney complications associated with diabetes. Number 7. Excessive Salt Salt, or sodium chloride, is vital for numerous bodily functions. However, excessive salt intake can burden the kidneys, which filter waste from your blood. This overload starts with hyperfiltration, where the kidneys work overtime to eliminate surplus salt. The challenge arises because salt molecules are cumbersome for passage through the kidney nephrons, leading to elevated glomerular pressure. This increased workload not only strains the kidneys but also increases the risk of kidney damage and disease. Additionally, Excessive salt consumption can disrupt the delicate sodium-potassium balance, further compromising kidney function. The World Health Organization who recommends consuming less than 2 grams of sodium per day per person. However, Americans typically exceed this limit by 50%, primarily due to the prevalence of processed foods high in sodium. To maintain optimal kidney health, 
consider reducing sodium intake and flavoring your meals with herbs and spices instead of salt. For instance, opt for garlic powder instead of garlic salt. Develop the habit of scrutinizing food labels while shopping, prioritizing fresh meats, fruits, and vegetables over packaged options, which tend to contain higher sodium levels. It may take around 6 to 8 weeks for your taste buds to adjust to lower sodium levels. Once accustomed, you might find that previously enjoyed foods like potato chips taste overly salty. Number 6. Excessive Sugar Intake Excessive sugar intake can lead to dire consequences for kidney health. When blood sugar levels exceed 180 mg per dl, your kidneys begin secreting sugar into your urine, marking the onset of potential kidney damage. High blood sugar can harm the delicate blood vessels in your kidneys, impairing their filtration function. This damage can result in proteinuria, where valuable proteins are lost in urine, eventually progressing to chronic kidney disease and possibly end-stage renal failure. A study published in Frontiers in Nutrition in 2023 and reported by Harvard Health highlighted an 88% increased risk of kidney. Stone formation in individuals consuming 25% or more of their daily calories from added sugars compared to those with lower sugar intake. To safeguard kidney health and prevent kidney stone formation, it's crucial to reduce added sugar consumption. Limit processed foods and sugary drinks, opting instead for whole foods and natural sweeteners. A kidney-friendly diet should emphasize fruits, vegetables, healthy fats, and lean proteins while minimizing salt, sugar, and refined carbohydrates. By making these dietary adjustments, you can mitigate the health risks associated with excessive sugar intake and promote kidney health. Number 5. Excessive Meat Excessive meat intake, particularly red meat, can significantly impact kidney health. Red meat generates a higher acid load during digestion compared to plant-based proteins, which can strain the kidneys and contribute to the development or acceleration of chronic kidney disease CKD. This increased acidity over time may even lead to kidney failure. Substituting red meat with leaner protein sources like fish, poultry, or plant-based options can substantially reduce the risk of kidney damage. Plant-based proteins and lean meats produce less dietary acid and fewer harmful byproducts, such as advanced glycation and products and uremic toxins. Studies indicate that a high intake of acid-producing red meat combined with a low intake of base-producing plant proteins like chickpeas or beans could induce kidney injury. Therefore, swapping red meat for plant-based protein sources, such as soy and legumes, is advisable to protect kidney health. Number 4. Overusing Painkillers Overusing painkillers, a condition known as analgesic nephropathy, can severely harm your kidneys. This often arises from long-term use of over-the-counter medications like acetaminophen, aspirin, ibuprofen, or naproxen. Despite their easy availability, these drugs should not be taken daily or regularly without consulting a healthcare provider first. Many Americans have suffered kidney damage by using these medicines excessively. For individuals with chronic kidney disease or end-stage renal disease ESRD, painkillers pose a significant threat. They can reduce blood flow to the kidneys, impair kidney function, and potentially lead to kidney failure. Moreover, painkillers may elevate blood pressure, worsening kidney damage in these patients. It's essential to be cautious with painkiller use and seek medical advice if experiencing any of these symptoms. Number 3. Ignoring the urge to urinate. Ignoring the urge to urinate, often termed ignoring nature's call, can have serious health consequences, including kidney damage. When urine doesn't empty completely from the body, it can lead to a condition called hydronephrosis, where the kidneys swell. Left untreated, hydronephrosis can progress to kidney failure. Continually postponing urination also raises the risk of urinary tract infections UT is because an overly full bladder becomes a breeding ground for bacteria. These infections can spread to the kidneys, causing further damage. Additionally, holding in urine for prolonged periods can overstretch the bladder, potentially harming it and exerting pressure on the kidneys, leading to kidney damage. Moreover, delaying urination can cause tears in the bladder wall over time, reducing its capacity and increasing the likelihood of urinary tract infections, which can escalate into kidney infections or sepsis. To safeguard kidney health and manage the urge to urinate effectively, take regular bathroom breaks and heed the urge promptly. Urinate right after waking up to kickstart your day and establish a regular urination cycle. 
Setting alarms every two to three hours for bathroom breaks can help alleviate pressure and prevent emergencies. Number two, neglecting urinary tract infections. Neglecting urinary tract infections UTs can have serious consequences. UT is bacterial infections affecting parts of the urinary system like the bladder, kidneys, or urethra are usually treatable with antibiotics. However, if left unattended, they can worsen, potentially spreading to the kidneys, causing a condition called pyelonephritis. This can result in permanent kidney damage or even sepsis, a life-threatening response to infection. The urinary system is essential for filtering waste and balancing fluids in the body. When bacteria accumulate in the urinary tract, infections can occur, leading to symptoms such as pain, frequent urination, burning sensation, cloudy or bloody urine, and persistent urges to urinate. Research indicates that elderly individuals with chronic kidney disease, especially women with kidney stones, are more vulnerable to upper urinary tract infections. Therefore, it's crucial to seek medical attention if you experience symptoms like burning or pain during urination. Your doctor may conduct tests, especially if you have other urinary or kidney issues like kidney stones, as chronic kidney infections can lead to severe complications such as pus buildup in the kidney, potentially resulting in kidney function loss. Number 1. High Blood Pressure High blood pressure poses a significant threat to kidney health. It damages the blood vessels that supply blood to the kidneys, making them stiff and reducing blood flow. This impairment extends to the tiny blood vessels inside the kidneys responsible for filtering blood, leading to further damage. The relationship between high blood pressure and kidney damage is concerning because it affects the nephrons, the kidneys' filtering units. When the blood vessels supplying these nephrons are damaged, they receive insufficient oxygen and nutrients, exacerbating kidney impairment. This creates a harmful cycle where kidney damage complicates blood pressure control, potentially resulting in kidney failure. Research underscores the importance of early detection and treatment of high blood pressure to prevent kidney disease. By implementing these measures, individuals can significantly reduce the risk of developing kidney damage due to hypertension. As people age, the risk of kidney and urinary tract diseases increases. When kidney disease becomes severe, certain symptoms may arise. 1. Swelling in hands and feet. This occurs because the kidneys struggle to balance fluids, leading to fluid retention and bloating in the limbs. 2. Fatigue and weakness. Erythropoietin, a hormone crucial for red blood cell production and energy levels, decreases with kidney disease, potentially causing anemia and persistent fatigue. Muscle twitches and cramps. Imbalances in electrolytes due to kidney function issues can result in muscle twitches and cramps. 4. Cognitive impairment, buildup of toxins in the blood, stemming from impaired kidney function, may lead to cognitive fog and difficulty thinking clearly. 5. Back pain. Persistent back pain can be a sign of kidney distress, whether from damage or the development of kidney stones. 6. Increased urination. Frequent urination as the kidneys attempt to expel waste more frequently can indicate kidney distress. Recognizing these signs early is crucial for addressing kidney disease. Early detection and management can significantly alter the course of to maintain kidney health. It's essential to adopt a healthy lifestyle, including a balanced diet low in processed foods, staying hydrated, and avoiding harmful substances like tobacco and excessive alcohol. Regular physical activity, aiming for a healthy weight, and managing underlying health conditions like diabetes and hypertension are also crucial. In addition to these lifestyle changes, avoiding certain daily habits that can harm the kidneys, these include excessive intake of salt, sugar, meat, and caffeine, overuse of painkillers, ignoring urinary urges and infections, sitting for prolonged periods, not getting enough sleep, and excessive alcohol and caffeine. Prioritizing a healthy lifestyle can help protect kidney health and promote overall. If experiencing symptoms or concerns related to kidney health, consulting a doctor for proper evaluation and guidance is If you're finding our video helpful, drop us a like to let us know, and we'll continue creating content like Please feel free to share your insights in the comments below, so we can learn from each other along our journey for a healthy life. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.